Hey there guys, welcome to my Neverwinter video. We are here in the rooftops of Protector's Enclave. Uh, and then today's video is me opening 70 of the new, well I say new, uh, of the giant lockboxes. Um, I have no idea what to expect from them as I haven't opened any yet. So I've got 70 keys and let's just go ahead. I'll open them all first in one go and then we'll see what we get from them. Uh, so, okay, so if we just open them now, and then we'll come back to it, and then have a look at what we get. Okay, guys, that's 70 of them. I'll just go back to the beginning to see what we got. Got a few things that are showing up. So we've got a gigantic strong box, which is just major vouchers. Uh, trade bars, we got ice pack artifact, uh, which is, well, it's artifacts and refinement stones, so, alright, Astorian relics, nothing special there, Astorian relics again, nothing special, frozen companion pack, so that's always nice to have, I actually want quite a few of them, again, frozen pack, crystallized enchantment pack, always nice, nothing new, uh, mystic mount pack, now this is interesting, because you might, you have a chance of getting the heavy mystic Nightmare Mount, uh, which is like the flaming undead horse thing. Um, unlikely I'll get it, but you know, never know. Uh, another crystallized enchantment pack, always nice to have. Gigantic stronghold, uh, again, crystallized, gigantic. Now, yes, that's what we want. Trade bars, always handy to have. Ice pack, ice pack, Astorian. Frozen, what's the frozen ones? Uh, bondings, runestones, yeah. Those are something else that actually... Uh, that popped up before, that said we got. Uh, so let's see what we have. Uh, artisan's profession, so it's a profession thing. Uh, and then... Oh, here we go. We actually got a Manticore companion. That's actually quite handy to have. Well, not for me, but... Quite good. Uh, chance to knock down your target on a critical attack. Not great effect, but you know, it's always good to sell, I suppose. Don't know how much they go for. Uh, keep going. Frozen. Usual stuff. Uh, Alright, so that's about it. So let's just, if we go and open these up, see what we get. So let's just have a look at this uh, companion first. Inspect companion. So it's basically the Manticore. Um, I think it's probably worth more if it was a mount than a companion. But it has three offense slots, one neck, one waist, and one sword knot. Uh, and the active effect is 5% 5 5 chance to knock down your target on a critical strike. Um, so I guess that's okay, but not necessarily great, because most enemies don't really get knocked down. Uh, so if we open... Let's open these gigantic ones first, just get the vouchers out of the way. So we got uh, Treasure, Tyranny, Dark, Surplus, Influence, which is nice, Fey Trinket, and Frozen. Okay, if we do the Ice Pact Artifact now, I'll open them all again in one go. Uh, so we got, let's see what we got. Uh, Mark to Potency, Aquamarine, Potency, Marine, yep, that's... Always great to have. Preservation Ward. Black Opals. We actually got... Oh, cool. We actually got a Shard of Alindra's Crown. That is brilliant. I know that with the update, now all the drops, like, it's easier to get stuff than it used to be. Uh, but still, you know, I've just got two things that are quite quite valuable, so hopefully be able to sell that, or we might maybe use it, depending on what character I have. Uh, again, Force, Sapphire, Opals, Blood Ruby. Um, <laughs> we got, we actually got two Shard of a Windrush Crowns now. That's uh, that's brilliant. That's never happened before. Like, I've done a few of these videos where I've opened up loads of stuff and I've got next to nothing. And on this one, I get a mount, uh, sorry, a companion and two Shard of a Windrush Crown. Let's see if we can make it a third. <laughs> No, nope, only two. Only give us two this time. Right, if we do the let's do the 
artisan's profession just get that out of the way so again nothing special for that one I can just open them up not too bothered about them uh, mystic mount pack let's see what we get from that uh, insignias oh we actually got a purple insignia then as well which one was it insignia of skill which is 200 crit that's nice to have that's actually I need that as well so that's even better we actually got a howler mount as well uh, what is it I can't inspect it can I no. After I'll check that out in a sec. Right. Keep going, and that. So we got two um, purple uh, insignias, which was this one was the power one. Right, let's just check this howler out, shall we? Inspect and preview. It's basically this thing. It's a weird. I don't even. I don't even know what. Oh, it's the. Um, it kind of looks like those uh, enemies you get in the dread ring that you have to kill. Just a weird, different version of it. All right, if we carry on. Okay, next one we'll do the Ostarian relics again. Nothing too special from that. I think the only good thing we can get from that is a purple uh, Ostarian relic, but we got we didn't get one, so I'm not bothered. Uh, what else? We've got the Frozen Companion Pack. We've got six of them. Let's see what we get. So, two Companion Tokens. Usual stuff. Yep. I would have liked more of those, to be honest, because I do need the Companion Tokens. Uh, but that's that's what we got. Right, so this one is the last uh, set we have to open. So, again, I'll open them all in one go and then see what we get. Alright, so we actually got Superior Mark, two Rank 7s, Greater... Rank 7s you're going to get from these all the time anyway, so it makes no difference. Um, so really the thing I want in more is the superiors and the greater marker potencies. Uh, we got two superior marker potencies so far. Uh, and just two. That's that's it, guys. Um, let me just make sure I haven't got anything else to open. Uh, but that, that that is it guys the I'd like to say the thing that I got the most that I was I actually enjoyed getting was the shard of a wonder crown two of them mind you and obviously the Halor was okay but you know nothing special but two shards of a Windras. I'm probably gonna put those up for sale see how much they go for and that's it um I'd, as a lockbox this giant one nothing too special to be honest it's a lot to the runic one you seem to get the same stuff. I think the best lockbox out there uh, for you know prizes is probably the uh, glorious resurgent one. You, you know, you've got a chance of getting very mounts. I think that's the best one. I think that's probably the next one I'll do again. Um, I probably won't open any of the new ones unless they're amazing stuff inside them. Um, uh, but that's it, guys. Uh, thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to my videos, and stay tuned for more Neverwinter content.